everybody. Looking ahead this morning, the annual Wine and Food Festival is happening this weekend. It's all for a great cause, too. Now, Justin, uh, I feel like we've, we've done this, and due to some unfortunate things, you know, we've had to put it off finally making it happen. Well, buddy, you know, COVID did, did kind of take a toll on yeah. festivals, and yeah. so we're happy to be back. The Arkansas Food and Wine Festival, it's the third edition in our third location. We're over at the Penning Boys and Girls Club mm -hmm. this year, and we're excited about it. There are so many different facets to the festival, DJ. Mm -hmm. There's some competition. There's okay. tons of food, lots of great wine. We're going to talk about with Anthony here. Yep. But uh, go to ARTianFestival.com. That's the sign up for all the competitions. Mm -hmm. we got bocce. You can see we're going to delve into, but lots <laughs> yes. of different things. It's really a multifaceted event, and it's all for a great cause. Yeah, Pinnock Boys Club. I, I grew up going to Pinnock Boys Club. I remember those days back in the day playing basketball there. But just the involvement of what the Boys and Girls Club does for kids at such a young age, especially someone like me needing to get out and about and having that mentorship, it goes such a long way. So it's such a big thing that we come out here and support. And that being said, now you said the Italian way of saying Anthony is... What'd you say? I guess Antonio. Antonio. Okay, Antonio is here. This it's way morning. more Italian than Justin. Yeah, I'll say that. So I'm the expert. Yeah. Let's talk about our, uh, what we got here as far as these drinks are concerned. So, so I work for Central Distributors, and we're happy to partner with the Boys and Girls Club to help at a great cause like this. And we have about 10 to 12 vendors that are that are real big Italian wine vendors that are going to be at the festival. Yep. And we're not only selling wine at the event, but we're doing wine tastings nice. on Friday and Saturday night. So you're going to taste about 50 plus Italian wines, Ooh. some domestic wines. Um, I know we don't personally have beer, but there'll be beer there. Okay. Um, and for those of you that don't like beer or wine, we have Old Dominic Distillery that's out of Memphis. It's actually in, uh, the Canale family is Italian oh, immigrants yes. that, that came over. Uh, I think in 1866. Yes. So they have wine, vodka, gin, whiskey. Those those cocktails will be for sale as well as a tasting tent. So yeah. really, you'll get a lot of. Uh, of everything you want, food, wine, beer, spirits, the whole gamut this weekend. Yeah, fair enough. Some Italians know how to drink some wine now. You said 50? 50 plus wine. Yeah, call your Ubers yeah. ahead of time. <laughs> yeah, please it, drink you know, responsibly. You know, but beyond that, imagine pairing that up with playing some fun games too. It could right. be an event. Tell us, what is this whole bocce ball? So bocce, my friend has, says a very simple thing. It's a little intimidating for those who haven't played, but basically you roll the little ball out and then you roll the big balls at the little ball. That's kind of the deal. <laughs> okay, so fair enough. you're trying to get the most, uh, your balls closer to the Polino in the middle there. And uh, so that'll be the goal. And then we actually have a payout here. So it's a hundred dollar buy-in for this. Nice. And there's a thousand dollar first oh, prize. Oh, come on, Hunter. We got to sell it up. <laughs> Sign up. It's very easy. And look, I will tell you this, DJ. The guys that won the last time we had this, they yeah. had never played before. So it's yeah. not hard to do. You Anthony can good, tell you. You yeah. missed a good part of it, though. When What's you're playing box, you have to have a glass of wine or a beer. You don't or have a choice. Yeah. No. Okay, it's yeah. pretty, much, pretty much like any outdoor game. You have to have a little drink with you. One, uh, with all one hand, cup in the other. We've I also like got it. a sauce cooking competition. Okay. You can, again, all these things you can sign up at ARItalianFestival.com. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have a waiters race, DJ, on Sunday. Hilarious. So local waiters and bartenders, they'll carry a tray around. First one to finish with their tray intact. Nice. Again, big pay. It's got a thousand dollar prize. Thousand dollars for that. Paid one through four on that, so we need to get local restaurant tours okay. and bar owners get their folks involved. You can sign up online. It's a blast. So there's a lot of different things going on through the days. And don't forget the grape stomp too, which is a blast. Ooh, yes. We've got some celebrity folks. Hopefully we we'll get some folks from KRK involved. I got to get out there. And then we've got uh, some radio personalities locally that are going to stomp up. But it's open to the public. We've got some opportunities for people just to show up with kids, adults that can stomp. Real quick, tickets. Yeah, ten dollars okay. for adults, ten and under free, okay. and you can get those at the gate. And then uh, the wine, the wine event is a ticketed event within the event at thirty-five bucks. That gets you in the event as well. That'll and then you get to taste that for just oh my goodness, it's going to be a weekend. And there's plenty of wine just for sale within the yeah. festival. Website as well. real quick so they hit it again. Yeah, ARitalianFestival.com, real easy. God, let's make it happen this year, right? That's <laughs> what I'm talking about. Thanks for being here. Well, see if we can figure this bocce ball out. We got a thousand dollars to win, Hunter. We got it. Yeah.